but I thought I'd stop by to make a quick cook like a dad recipe. And today's recipe is called tuna guacamole. Now we're not using avocados and making that kind of recipe. We're making a cook like a dad recipe using a can of tuna and some easy simple ingredients. And just as a reminder, a cook like a dad recipe is so simple that if a dad can make it, anyone can make it. So come on and enjoy this new recipe called tuna guacamole. Okay, the main ingredients for the tuna guacamole are going to be a red onion. I'm going to do a nice fine chopped red onion. A Roma tomato. Any tomato will work fine. I like using the Roma tomato. I'm going to take a lime. And I have cilantro. Now, if you're not familiar, you get in the regular mayonnaise section in your grocery store. It's light, it's spicy, and it adds just the right kick to my tuna guacamole. The next item is herdez. Green verde salsa, or my friends in the south would call it herdez. This green salsa is in any um, international section, Mexican food section, next to the salsas. Uh, it's very affordable and it has just the right kick for my tuna guacamole. And finally, of course, tuna. What better way to have tuna for your tuna guacamole than having Starkus tuna? While I do that, I'm going to take my tomato and give it a nice fine chop after I slice it. And if you're particular or your kids are particular to the goo, you can of course rinse out these little wagon wheels and get the goo out. I particularly like the goo in my tuna guacamole. So just make sure it's kind of like a coarse chop. So you got a nice chunky dip. Take that in there, drop it in there, grab your cilantro. Take it about a handful of cilantro, cutting it up with my hands, and drop it into my dish like this. Then I take my lime, slice the lime, take it one half, squeeze it over my mixture like that. I'm going to take my red onion. Oh, and by the way, cook like a dad always says, keep your onion wet and your knife wet, and you won't have any tears. Nobody likes a crybaby in the kitchen. So I have my onion slice, I'm going to take that onion slice and I'm going to cut it like this. I'm taking about half an onion slice here, I don't want to dominate my flavor with the onion. A red onion is going to be sweeter and lighter and milder than a white onion. You can use a yellow onion, I just prefer the red onion, I'm a red onion kind of guy. Okay, now this is where the spicy mayo comes in. I don't want it too dry and before I put the, the Verde sauce, I'm going to put just a dab of this crust okay, so you spicy add mayo. as much or as little as you want of the green salsa and just mix it in. You don't want to put too much because it makes it too sloppy. But that green Verde sauce just makes a great addition to this mixture. Add your favorite chips and dip. And tell you what, you've got a great recipe for any type of weekend activity, family activity, or just having a, a nice party and you want to add a different type of dip. The tuna guacamole is a cook like a dad recipe and I hope you enjoy it.